Hello everyone and welcome back to another video. So in this video I wanted to show you all the things that I got at the thrift store, um, well the miniatures that I never got to show you before. So I'm going to do that and then I also have a small other thrift store haul which I will be sharing you all the little miniatures that I found in that one. So, leave this bag. I got two of these bags for free. So, this one has some really cute things in it. Just gonna open it. As you can see, this one was a dollar ninety nine, but I only paid nothing for this one. So this one has some pins that I can use for crafting or sewing. And what is Oh, I didn't even see. Those are so cute. These are some charms. But they're letters, like brass letters. You can see that. I'm not using my bright light today so that you can see better. Well, it's already open, so I can even show you even better. So it looks like these little... They're for um, bracelets or something. They're little letters. And so you can use them for um, signs or doorbells or doors or something. That's really cute. There's a whole little container of those. And um, oh, I guess these are like Merry Christmas tags for presents and stuff like that. You can use these as um, decorations for the dolls. Or you can use them for life-size presents. I think this is a bag of bells, but I'm not sure. I'm just going to take one out and show you. I'm hoping this isn't a super long video. Oh, okay, so it's not like a... I have no idea what this is. It does look like a tiny little bell. It just doesn't make a lot of noise. Oh, still cute, and I think it would make a cute miniature bell. Kind of want to get this stuff shown to you. I know Christmas is long over now, but I'm s I just put away our house decorations yesterday. Um, some more pins with little eyes on them. So not 100% sure what those are for. And these look like charms for bracelets. Oops. You can see that. Kind of cute. And there's some little gems in there as well. But it looks like you could probably use these as. Um, I guess they're called bangle bracelets for dolls. And then it came with some tea lights, which I'll probably use for myself. Um, some random chain. Not entirely sure what I would use those for. There's two of those. Um, oh, these are like the um, for your for necklaces or bracelets, the little clippy thing that you can pinch open and close, and then the circle part. So that's actually pretty cool. You can make. This must be for jewelry making, earrings and stuff, uh, more of those 
those pins with the holes, loops at the end. If you can see that. And then another tea light in this bag, and that's everything in that bag. And then this bag, I believe, yeah, so I paid for one bag, $1.99, and another bag, this bag, I paid $0.99, cents. and then I got the other two for free. So in this one, I got a thing of golden shimmery ribbon. That's really pretty. could probably use that in doll clothes making, maybe. Oh yes, this was one of the reasons why I bought this one. So I can use it for Christmas decorations for the dollhouse, the ghost sparkly that is. That would look really neat in the dollhouse. If it will stand. Oh, it does stand on its own. Awesome. And it also came with this really cute um, velvet house. It looks kind of like a birdhouse. And it's an ornament, but I think it would look cute in the dollhouse as well. And then, oh, these are really cute. These are also ornaments, but I, they would look really good in the dollhouse too. Hmm. Let me see. Let's see if I can do anything there. There we go. I see a reindeer in here. Oh, these are super cute. They would look really good. So there's like little reindeer. A little reindeer and another little reindeer, little Christmas tree, and a snowflake, and a little penguin. That's so cute. So I'm not using that bright light tonight, and I hope you can see okay. So I'm going to try this out and we'll see how this goes. And that's it for that bag. <coughs> Moving on to the next one. It's actually going faster than I thought. Oh. <sighs> Look at that. That is so cute. It's a little reindeer decoration and he's holding like this brass thing with all these toys on them and presents. There's a little gingerbread man, candy cane, and well, those are just his gloves and then a little present. And he's actually got a fabric um, scarf on. That's <laughs> so cute. I don't know if you can see him very well. He's really cute though. That's so Christmassy. And he stands really good on his own too. Oh my goodness. Oh, that's, this is a little Christmas man, or a, Christmas, a snowman holding like Christmas lights. And it's a brooch. So I could even wear this. That's freaking adorable. That's so cute. Or I could use it for a decoration in the dollhouse. Either or. I'm really happy with this. That's so cute. That's so cute. Oh, and this is really nice. It's an ornament. Oh no. This is, uh, well I guess it might have been an ornament. But this is actually Santa's sleigh and it's so cute that's the bottom and these are like the straps I thought it was like the hanging thing but they go around the reindeers that's really cute and there's Santa right there so cute 
That would look really cute in the dollhouse. I still have to do a quick video before I take all my Christmas decorations down um, to show you. Oh, it's just been so crazy here. And then the last thing in this bag is this beautiful little angel ornament. I could use this on my tree or I could put it in the dollhouse somewhere. But, yeah, she's actually quite pretty. She kind of almost reminds me of a Barbie. Her face, I don't know if you can see that. But yeah, it's kind of neat. Okay, the last bag that I got in that first haul. This one has got some cute things in it. So this one has a red bow or ribbon. Oh, this is pretty. A sparkly um, snowflake. I love it. I'm totally going to use this as like a decoration for the dollhouse. Okay, so uh, not related to Christmas, but it also came with a little Superman. Suppose I could use this in like a toy store. I'm currently building one for the past, I don't know how many years now. Oh, I need to finish it. And then this thing, oh, we had these and got rid of them a long time ago. But, oh, a little Paw Patrol. I think this is Rocky from Paw Patrol. My son will love this. He'll be so happy. <laughs> oh, and his head moves. Cool. Okay, now on to the Christmas stuff. All oh, these hang everything's hanging. Oh here's a Christmas ornament. It's kinda like a nutcracker with a trumpet or what are these guys called that are in bands? I can't remember, but he looks like a trumpet player. So that's really cute. That would look really good in the dollhouse. And then this really cute teddy bear on a rocking horse. That will look really cute in a diorama. I think I have something similar to that with a snowman. Oh. This is really cute too. It's a little teddy bear on top of some blocks that say Noel. Kind of looks like a monkey, but I think it's a teddy bear. But it looks like a monkey. I don't know. Cute either way. Okay, not Christmas again. But there's a little Batman. It looks like a drink topper or something. Not sure what. Oh, no, this thing moves. I don't know what it is, but cute anyway. <clears throat> I think the only Batman one movie that I really liked was The Dark Knight with Heath, Le Le Heath Ledger. I really like that one. Um, okay, this is also not Christmas related, but super cute. I think my son will like this too. He loves cats, kitties. Just two little sleeping kitties. Oh, this is cute. This is not Christmas related either. I think this is from Mexico. I have a little turtle exactly like this. Cute. Looks like a bull, a bull rider and a bull. Cute. And a choo-choo train ornament. And another trumpet player. And, oh, this is cute. A little elf or something like that with a little bell. That's really, with a fabric toque. Oh, this is super cute too. I love little wooden ornaments. They are so vintage like. 
a little teddy bear holding a tree. This is kind of weird looking. It's a little teddy bear with button eyes. Kind of cute. I think this came from a show or a movie, but I can't remember which one. And another it's a silver snowman. And here's a silver angel. And another silver thing, snowman or something, sitting on top of some books. Oh, this one is so cute. It's a little teddy bear with a ma mailbox. That's really cute. I like that. Oh, I really love this one too. It's a little drum with a Christmas tree and a present on it. That's really, I like this one too a lot. And the last but not least, another little teddy bear holding a present. Super cute. And that's it for those bags. So that cost me, I think, all of $3 for all of that. And I went on another thrift store <laughs> um, hunt and I found, or actually my nephew found it, but it's a Rainbow High Winter Break Ruby Red Doll for $2. $2. You couldn't believe it. Yeah. She's missing her other outfit, obviously, but she still has one of them, so I'm pretty, and she has her toque. I'm just really excited that, because I only have the Sunny in this line, because I decided I wasn't going to buy any more Rainbow High dolls. Um, but for $2, I think I could. And then I also found this really cute, this is another different thrift store haul. This was all I got there, this tiny little basket. It had some tea lights in there, but I took those out. I thought this would look really cute in a doll diorama, either as a baby bassinet or something. Not sure yet, but it was cute nonetheless. Oh, and this was 99 cents. And then uh, my son found these. These were 50 cents. I was actually going to buy them at the dollar store, but I didn't want to spend, and I can't remember, I think they were like 3 or $4 for this, and I didn't want to spend that. So for 50 cents, I got them, and I have a plan for a Barbie diorama for those as well. And then I got another bag of stuff which cost me 75 cents because every all the red tags were 50% off and it was $1.50 so I'm going to go through this bag quickly and then that's it for this video oh this is so cute I can get it out of here. Okay, this is interesting. It is completely tangled, so um, this piece looks like some kind of um, hanging ornament. And, oh, there it goes. Okay, so this must be an ornament on its own. That's kind of neat. It's like a star with some leaves and stuff like that. You could use it in the dollhouse as like a sitting ornament or something. And this is what was tangled in there. This super cute little Christmas tree made from beads. Someone beaded this all together. That's really neat and really pretty. And then I also 
also got, this is a magnet that I thought I could use it on the wall of maybe my Barbie cafe or something. Live, love, laugh, well, oh, live well, love much, and laugh often. And it also came with this nativity scene on that ornament. That's really pretty. I might use that on my Christmas tree. Oh, it's already been taken down. Oh, and then these are some glass mirror shapes. Oh, this would be a great idea for the dollhouse. I already have a good idea for them. Oh, that's really pretty. Really neat. And then a cross. Neat. It's wooden. And the last thing in there, which I thought was really neat, was this. I think it was an ornament too. Uh, it's a little birdhouse. And it's got like gems crystal gems on the outside and on the back and then it has a little hole on the inside you can put a little fake bird in there or something I just thought this was so freaking cute and it would look great in the doll diorama dollhouse somewhere not sure where yet but I think it's really cute and that is everything that I got um, in the thrift stores in those little bags. So I hope you enjoyed this video. I enjoyed showing you all the neat little treasures that I found. And I hope you guys are having a wonderful and happy 2024 year. And I look forward to seeing you much more. And yeah, have a good night. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.